Okay, so I'm going to be trying to show how I make my fursuit paws, how I do the foaming for them. So, okay, what you're going to need is paper, foam, high density foam, a hot glue gun, and scissors. Okay, first what you want to do, which I've already done, is trace out a shape for the paw that you want. I also traced out some paw pads that I might add, but I'm not sure yet. So you want to trace that out on paper, make sure it's pretty symmetrical, and then you're going to put it on. Okay, so I've traced my paper cutout onto the foam, and I'm going to cut it out. Now that I have it cut out, I'm going to start foaming up the toes on the side. And it is basically the same as that, so yeah. Okay, so I cut out two of these. It's short on the side, a little bit longer on the side, long and flat down here, long and flat at the top, and then it diagonals off. You want it to be about as long as right along this toe. Okay, so I put hot glue on the long side here, and I wrapped it around on top to border one of the outside toes. And we're going to do that on both sides. Up to here and around to about here. Once you've done this twice, your two outside toes will start to look like this. Which, this is a little curved at the bottom so it looks different. But they'll look like this and now we're going to do the same thing for the inside toes, only around here with a long rectangular shape instead of the drop-off that we have on the back here. I've cut out the two rectangles here, and along here is as long as around the inside toe. After you put the rectangles on the inner toes, you'll get something that looks like this. Now what we want to do is... Focus, focus. Okay. Now what we want to do is cut triangles in to the tops and then gluing the two pieces together where the triangle was to give it a rounded shape on the toes. Here is where I've cut two triangles in. This is the outside toe and an inside toe. After you cut out the triangles, you glue the two pieces together and it'll come and look like this. Where it's a little curved as these are straight without triangles yet. Okay so now I've done the triangle and gluing to every single toe and here I have glued the two toes the outside and the inside toe together and we're also going to glue along here to glue the two inside toes together and then the outside and the inside toe together. So it looks like this. And we're starting to get the full form of our toes, which go on here. Now the toes are complete. And you can trim up on around the top. Maybe trim up in between to get the full toes. And then we are going to do the top of the feet, which are these, here. And how to attach it to a digigrade if you have already made this. I've already made this. I don't think I'm going to be showing this part, but I'll teach you how to substitute in if you're not going to be doing the full digigrade. So this is what I'm going to be working with. This is the digigrade that I have for the back of my uh, calf, and it has, I put these long pieces on the side, so you're going to be gluing these into right here to spread out like I have here. Or if you're not doing this, which more people won't be doing this for the foot paws, just take a simple piece of foam and just wrap it around the inside here. Now I've attached my digigrade to the back. If you don't have this, you can just take one of these strips of foam, just kind of wrap it around like a tube. And now we're going to put this over here. I glued on the strip and I glued some of the toes to it and voila, my feet. I just have to glue on the top of the toes like I have here, but I don't have time. So, there you go. Some feet.